you know, I think that the hype now is warranted. I think the hype is allowing us to ask the right questions. You know, I remember six years ago where we said, you know, I would talk to clinicians. I want AI for what? You know, mm -hmm. and it was very unclear what that actually even meant. Uh, and now we can we can have a conversation about what it is I wanted to do, how I'd like it to impact my workflow, uh, and we can have meaningful conversations about that. I, I think that we're at such, such a different place than we were uh, five years ago, and I think that it's a much better place in terms of how we're talking about this technology. I think the reason why we're in a good place now, at least with convolutional neural networks and NLP that have been out for a few years, is because we've come off that hype curve, not because we're on it. We are, however, on the hype curve for generative AI. And I think we need to be careful there because regulation is far behind, ethics are far behind, and the technology, while there are so many awesome things, and I think everything is gonna move toward that, it's gonna move, um, I think, a little more slowly than you might imagine, only because you hear about the hype. So you're hearing everything it potentially do.